A group under the auspices of uh, Concerned Youth Forum from Taraba Nasirwa and Benue State as well as professional residents in Kaduna State have vowed to deliver block vote to the All Progressive uh, Congress candidates. Uh, speaking in Tsabo Tasha Kaduna, the forum coordinator to have Madugo said youths uh, constitute a large number of voters that yearn for leaders with good track record to bring them out of the challenges the country is facing. We look at the track records of any aspirant in, this, in, in, in our uh, uh, aspirant, yeah? So we have discovered that among the senators, not only in Cardinal State, in the town of North, they have done more than those others that have been there for long. And we see, we know that he's a humanitarian. So we have to work, work along with him, work along with him, make sure that we, we support him so that he can win and come as a governor of the state and continue the good work he has started in the National Assembly there. I call to the other youth these days that they should look at the one who will bring democracy, the dividend of democracy within, I mean, for them. Also, the national coordinator of the Progressive Party's uh, platform, Adibayo Emmanuel, said that 16 years of the past administration has failed to bring development to Kaduna State. Nation building is not a 100 meter dash, it's a marathon. One of the things we've had in Nigeria is that in the past, before the APC government came to the rescue of Nigeria, a lot of underdevelopment has taken place. I want to assure Nigerians of is that if 16 years of PDP, they didn't learn a lesson in, from bad governance, then I think they need to have a rethink. Because what is APC has endeavored to do in the last eight years is to correct the wrongs of the past and then build a solid foundation for a greater and a better developed nation at the national level and in Kaduna State. Also, the governorship candidate of APC Kaduna State, uh, Senator Uba Sani, promised to prioritize youth and women and also provide adequate security in the state for businesses and entrepreneurship to thrive. We'll have uh, space for women and youth. That is in terms of skill acquisition centers, in terms of trades and investments. Uh, we are going to support entrepreneurs in, by way of grant and or loan. So I want to assure you that uh, our, uh, the, the APC administration in 2023 will go a long way in helping the youth and women. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.